Almost a year ago today, we started a YouTube channel. A YouTube channel that my friend Tom, Chris, and myself built from the ground up. And almost a year after that, I'm standing here all alone with nobody. No Tom, no Chris, no super goons. Look, I don't believe in Christmas miracles. I'm sure as heck not gonna start believing in them tonight. But what the heck do I have to lose anymore? I wish with all my heart that the Super Goons will come back for an amazing season three. And we come back stronger and better than ever. But even if I did decide to pick up a camera, Tom's away at college and Chris is lost in space. And you can't wish a person back. Or could you? Tom? Tom, how do you... Well, somebody did ask for a Christmas miracle, Joey. And quite honestly, I am a little disappointed because I was just on a hot dinner date with this hot freaking drop dead gorgeous girl next to palm trees on the beach in Florida with beautiful degrees. And now, well, somehow I'm here in the frozen tundra standing next to you. I don't understand. How are you here? I'm just as confused as you are. Like I said, like 10 seconds ago, I was standing on the beach with one hot chick. And now I'm here standing next to you. So Christmas miracles are real after all. <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm just playing with you, just messing around. I was uh, just walking down the street and I saw you standing over here next to the tree and well then I overheard you talking to the tree. Not sure what that was about, but uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. No, no magic or anything like that involved, really. <laughs> Tom, man, you have no idea how much I missed you. I mean, after everything that's happened, you know, you moving away, whatever happened to Chris, everything died. The channel died. All hope was lost. I know, man. Trust me, I, I know. And about Chris, that, that's why I'm in town, Joey. The night we made that deal with those extraterrestrial beings, I don't know, it's just like Super Goons hasn't been the same since then. Like something's missing, something's different. I think I've come up with a solution. A solution to get our friend back, Joey. The real Chris. What is it, Tom? I'll do anything to get him back. What is it? I'll do anything. It's not gonna be easy, buddy. It's not gonna be easy at all. Look, over the past four months of me being in college, I've implemented a plan every day, day in, day out. I didn't go to college to get away from you or Chris or anybody. I went there to do this, to study space exploration so we can get to space and we can save our friend. I put together the blueprints, everything we need to know to get there, to go to space, retrieve Chris and bring him back. But I need your help and I can't do it without you. <laughs> if we do this, we can end this preposterous idea of the paradox once and for all. Wow, Christmas miracles really do happen. What do we gotta do? I'll do it, whatever it is. Hey then, the blueprints right here hold everything we need to know about a successful rescue mission to Mars. Yeah, uh, well, now that I think about it, um, yeah, heights aren't really my thing. Uh, you know, a whole like six month deal trip, it's like one way trip there, how are we getting home, you know? I, yeah, freeze dried food? Nah, forget about it. I need like pick D's, you know? That's my thing. That's yeah. We're good. Wait. Yo, hey, hey, hey man. Hold on. Joey, you're kidding, right? Dude, I was just playing with you. We're going to Mars, baby. Ignition sequence start. Six, five, four, three. Two, one, zero, all engine running. Liftoff, we have a liftoff.